All right, now, gang, now, nah, listen here, man. What y'all been waiting for, what I've been waiting for, man, the 300 is back. It is ready. It was ready this morning. It's about 5 o'clock. I'm just not being able to go get it. So, I ordered my little lift. You get what I'm saying? We're going to pull up in a little lift. You know what I'm saying? Drop that paper off. We come get my car. Never, ever again will I ever take my car to the shop ever again. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to tell y'all why. We're going to get into these reasons in a second. Let me go pick the big 300 up. We might go get a car wash. You know what I'm saying? All right, guys. You know what I'm saying? We are here. You know what I'm saying? I see my beautiful, you know what I'm saying? Five seven. Five seven, you know what I'm saying? I come over here. I'm on the freaking flat. If y'all remember the video, I dropped my car off my this same tire had caught a slow leak. He said he plugged my tire, put air in it before, and it's still like that, man. So I don't know what the hell's going on, but the, the five seven, I thought it was be dirtier than this, but it's still looking good though, man. Sheesh. I haven't seen my car in so freaking long. All the other tires are held up, so you know we're gonna have to go get a car wash. And you got to put some air in that tire. I can't drive like that. You know what I'm saying? So, basically, I'm just waiting on him to come back so I can pay him the money. I go by my damn way. You know what I'm saying? But this video is going to be... I don't like bad shops or nothing like that. This has to, this has to be talked about. You get what I'm saying? So, without further ado, we're going to wait for this. And, uh, we're going to see what's going on next, man. So, this is the old radiator. Wow. So, how, what made you think? So, yeah, I see a crack right there. What made you... Like, what would have this like to happen, though? What would happen? Yeah. I pulled no coolant out of this thing. Really? So no. you think it just like, just like, what, which thing like caused it to just like just bust or over time or? Over time. Wow, that's crazy. So the water pump was fine though, right? Mm -hmm. That's crazy. Put the thermostat in. Man, uh, one put, of my guys. No gasket? Put two gaskets. Really? Yeah, all you need is one. Oh, okay. I flushed yeah. it out. Uh-huh. It took damn near two hours to flush out all the crap out of it. Really? Not out of this, out of your block. Out the block? Yeah. No way. Hey, I thought I had a blown head gasket. Mm -hmm. I had it running for about probably a half hour, 40 minutes. Usually had a gasket 10, 15 minutes. It'll start bubbling. It'll start, you know, heating up really quick. Yeah, somebody, yeah, somebody told me like to come get a, a pressure test or something like that. Compression test? Yeah, compression test. After I did the radiator, I ran it to see if it bubble off, or if you didn't have heat inside. You had heat inside. If you didn't get any heat inside, yeah, so would have been a head gasket. Wow. That's the easiest way to tell, really. Once you turn the car off, you hear a bubble, start boiling. Actually, you hear you hear the water boiling. Once you start hearing that, you know. Yeah, definitely got a head gasket. So, so you think my motor is like in good condition? Motor's good. Sounds good. Yeah. It just took forever to clear. Just get the junk out of it, the gunk out of it. Thank you. Yeah, I was, I was hoping it wasn't a radiator. I mean, it wasn't. Um, the head gasket. Yes, but I knew my radiator was bad because. Like, the, it wouldn't overheat, but it would start smoking, you know what I'm saying? It was coming out. This is the bottom. It was coming out of here. It was coming out over here. It was peeing from here all the way down. Wow, okay. That's crazy. Yeah, because, uh, it was, I got my car back from you last time. I, I, you know, I spent a lot of money last time, so I, like, cooled out on all the, you know what I'm saying, the crazy stuff and everything. If you should tell this other kid that we got from here, it's the same thing. Holy crap. For real? So, y'all, as y'all heard what he said, man, my radiator freaking busted. Now we're going to pull up to the third bay, you know what I'm saying? And we're going to go get some air in this freaking tire, man. Damn, slow down, bucko. Dang, oh my God. I haven't been in this seat in so freaking long, man. Like, all right, you know what I'm saying? So we are pulling off right now. So y'all don't know, you know what I'm saying? Rod Wave dropped that damn tape. So I got to play the new Rod Wave tape, you know what I'm saying? So, so far, this is what I've been banging right here, that changer, man. So, you know what I'm saying? 
We about to go get us a little car wash, man. Might go to the car meet, like I said, but man, we gonna tune in though, for sure. <laughs> All right, look, gang, we back at the tire shop getting more air. Y'all just seen me, y'all literally just seen me get air yesterday, man. So, this is like, you know what I'm saying, it's abnormal. So, I'm gonna come back here after I do what I gotta do. You know what I'm saying? Look at the dog, you know what I'm saying? I got another one just like him, but white. If you wanna buy, you know what I'm saying? Hit me the DM, you know what I'm saying? But, man, I hope I don't have a, 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 a cracked rim, but we're gonna come back up here. I get done doing what I gotta do that. I'm on the move, you know what I'm saying? Then we're gonna find out if I got a bent rim. But I'm already trying to get some new rims anyway, so it ain't nothing that's gonna be, you know what I'm saying? It ain't gonna do nothing but force me into the new rims. And, but yeah, man, we about to head up there and all that, you know what I'm saying? We about to link up with my boy Mont and T Baby. So, uh, we just see how we get there. All right, so I just told y'all we had to go get air again in that back right tire. I don't, I don't look so damn dark. I don't know if my rim is cracked or I don't know, man. Maybe it's just a bad tire. We're gonna end up getting that fixed, man. Uh, but yes, the 300 is finally back. It is freaking dirty and set. So I'm probably gonna just wash this off real quick. Look how muddy my tires is, dude. Look how muddy it is. My boy in here, you know what I'm saying? My boy T in here getting this boy looking good. You know what I'm saying? He got the five spokes, you know what I'm saying? Good five spokes. But uh, when you dropping this? Dropping this video. Oh, I'm trying to get it done like the daytime. So, this is gonna be dropped like Monday, y'all. But he got the front of the car silver, like again, you know what I'm saying? I had to tell him, go silver. He wanted to stay with the black hood, the black fenders, the black bumper. I said, no. I said, no, you know what I'm saying? Do this, and you're gonna get the car wrapped. I ain't gonna say what he's gonna do, you know what I'm saying? But, man, this boy looks so freaking good, just like this, man. So, I got some stuff in store. What I'm gonna do to my car is hold on, hold tight. It is here. It is back for the channel again, you know what I'm saying? So yes, look at the fire smokes. All right, y'all, so I totally forgot that I need a freaking car wash. And I'm not gonna get me an uh, oil change. My oil change is so long overdue, I'm scared to tell y'all how much it's over. So I'm gonna get my car a quick rinse, you know what I'm saying? He got this car a little quick, little wreck, you know what I'm saying? Even though he got a spot right there. I missed the rag. <laughs> but uh, I might get this boy a car wash oil change, you know what I'm saying? The car is back, so, man. I know I've been prolonging this video, telling y'all I'm gonna tell y'all what was wrong, and you know what I'm saying? But I'm gonna get home and let y'all know about the shop I went to. All right, y'all, so just like that, the Big 300, it's freaking washed. Got the rims looking nice, you know what I'm saying? Whoo, this boy has not been clean in so freaking long. This boy look good, man. I didn't, I just, you know what I'm saying? Missed the car so freaking much. This boy clean, man. Now the car wash is pretty much done. Let's go get the freaking oil change, y'all. Y'all see my boy T getting his car together, man. This boy looks so good with the bumper and uh, everything painted, man. But. You know what I'm saying? We got 300 right there chilling on ice, man. They doing that little job for that. All right, y'all, so we got the 300 all flush. Got a uh, ray coolant flush and a power steering flush, you know what I'm saying? Had to check the trans fluid, it all looked good. But, man, what I just had to see, what was wrong with my car with the coolant issue, y'all remember my coolant was very bad. So this guy at the shop ended up putting some cheap coolant and had that clay stuff back in there. After y'all seen, I had the clay out of my car and all that. So he put some cheap coolant. I don't know how, I don't know what he put in there, but I had to get everything flushed. So everything is flushed, you know what I'm saying? They said if I don't get a flush, it's gonna mess up, mess up the heater court. But man, this video is gonna get into the nitty gritty and I'm gonna tell y'all, don't bring your car to that guy, you know what I'm saying? Cause he ain't doing something right, you get what I'm saying? I ain't trying to bash no shops, you know what I'm saying? Make your money, but do everything right. So I'm gonna let y'all know the full uncut of everything that's going on. All right, y'all, boy, man, these guys had to hook me up. These guys gave me a ass deal on getting everything flushed out. My coolant, uh, oil change, and getting my freaking power steering flush, you know what I'm saying? So come up here, you know what I'm saying? I'll the job in Van Dyke right here, you know what I'm saying? Next to the Metro. Or change cash flow, man. These guys, man, did a number of good things for me for, you know what I'm saying, a good price. So if y'all tired of getting taxed, come up here, or change cash flow. 
Van Dyke and out of drive in the city, man. Shout out to these boys so much, man. Appreciate y'all for rocking with me, man. Ooh, gang, let's start this big V8 on up. Yes, yeah, sir, he's gonna turn that up for y'all. Shit, gang. We just hit 77,000 miles, man. So we can get this video started. Whoa, all right, gang, you know what I'm saying? This is like the, the next couple days after, you know what I'm saying? So y'all gonna be seeing this video tomorrow, you know what I'm saying? It's currently Sunday night, you know what I'm saying? Now, we got the big 300, you know what I'm saying? Y'all got the little cold start inside view and all that, you know what I'm saying? Sweet details and all that, but I'm gonna tell y'all, my car has been gone for damn near three freaking weeks. Now, it's about three weeks going on the fourth. You know what I'm saying? It shouldn't have took this long for me to get my car back. Like, last time I brought her my car, it took three weeks. Now, I got something simple. Granted, I did have him look into other things that he never got looked into. You know what I'm saying? So, I got so sick up. I got so sick and fed up to the point where I had to get my car. I said, listen, dude, you got this, you know what I'm saying? Get this done. Like, what? Did, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, what's the whole point of you waiting on? You keeping my car for three weeks, and you it's always something like, you know what I'm saying? And you go, and he told me he uh didn't have nobody in his shop. He told me I was going to be next. You know, my car was gone for three weeks, and all he fixed was the damn radiator, bro. Like, how? You know what I'm saying? I had him look at other stuff, granted. But, like, you move on your own time. This car is for my YouTube, you know what I'm saying? This car is what, you know what I'm saying? I used to get around with my daily YouTube. That's why I have not been uploading. I feel like it shouldn't have took three weeks to get some stuff looked at, which never got looked at. And once he told me my radiator came in, I'm like, bro, you can put the radiator in there. I can get my car do that. Don't worry about nothing. Don't touch shit else on my car. Get that done. You get what I'm saying? So, he might be watching this video. I don't know. But if you watching this video, man, I'm never coming back. That shit is ass. You get what I'm saying? Straight up. I'm not here to bash y'all. I won't be giving y'all the shop details. But if you find it in one of my old videos, me taking my car to the shop and picking it up, that's on y'all. You know what I'm saying? But I'm not here to bash them. Too bad. I just want to say the customer service is ass. My car was ready. You didn't even call me and let me know. You know what I'm saying? Like, who do that? You know what I'm saying? So, it just took way too long to get to get the car back. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is what I use for everything. You know what I'm saying? So, views been kind of down because I haven't had nothing to upload. I'm not putting out no shitty content. I would not upload before I put out some shitty. You know what I'm saying? If I don't feel like it's a good video, it ain't gonna go up there. You get know what I'm saying? That's how I am. I'm not putting out no bullshit content. It's always quality over quantity. You know what I'm saying? I'm sorry if I'm talking too fast, but it kind of got me heated up. Then, you know what I'm saying? Y'all seen I had the little clay in the radio, and I'm gonna show y'all this right here. It's like some foam stuff in there, man. Jeez, it looks yeah. like that foam sealer. The spray can. Great stuff. Yeah. So y'all seen I had that little build up clay and all that stuff. So me and T changed the thermostat and that's what fixed that. I put some more coolant in the car back then. The shit left away, boom. I go get an oil change, get a coolant flush, you know what I'm saying? So the, at the oil change, the guy ended up putting coolant inside the car and like the coolant foamed right back up, got right back orange and freaking just clayed right back up inside the reservoir. So this guy ended up Put a cheap ass coolant in my car and i just got over that problem so I had to get a whole coolant flush it was so much up coolant i was gonna record it but i'm like man i don't even want to look at that shit. it was so much it would look like chocolate milk that's how dark it was so he just put my motor at more and higher of a risk for him doing that man i just got over this and he seen what type of coolant was inside the car he says yeah i pumped all the bad coolant out and i told him that came from using cheap coolant you know what i'm saying if y'all use that auto zone coolant mixed with any color do not use that bull man that's what i that's what got me and the predicament i am in now he used that fucked up coolant in my car you get what i'm saying so i just had to pay all that much more money for a whole coolant flush, you know what I'm saying? So, do not go get no cheap coolant, you know what I'm saying? None of that, none of that, none of that type of, you know what I'm saying? If you're gonna do this, do it right, 
do it one time, you get what I'm saying? Do not go to these bullshit shops that's over here wax taxing and draining. Now, I don't got a problem. You do good work with me, you know what I'm saying? I got a problem. Give y'all a shout out, you know what I'm saying? None of that type of stuff, but you ain't gonna sit here and me over, you know what I'm saying? And make me wait three weeks. And you not even getting the little simple stuff I'm, I'm asking you for the ask for you to look at, you know what I'm saying? I'm not asking for a fucking motor rebuild, bro. You know what I'm saying? So it was just way too long of a waiting period, you know what I'm saying? So that whole that just didn't make sense, you know what I'm saying? I could have brought you my own fucking radiator, you know what I'm saying? And you just I called and asked him like what's up, what we gonna do with the radiator? He said I already ordered one. Like, I, I could have bought you one. It took too long, you know what I'm saying? Like I just don't understand. And everything I got from him was warranted. But the warranty money I spent, I don't even care about you would never like come touch my car again, you know what I'm saying? And that's just respectfully. I am straight of your business. It took too long, man. So that's just yeah, I'm not trying to bash him and and like leave hatred towards him, man, but it it, it just it, it makes no point, you know what I'm saying? It should have never it should have never like even got to that, you know what I'm saying? So man, watch these mechanics, man. Don't let them try to cheat you like shit and tax you and all that, you know what I'm saying? So I was so ready and getting yeah, so irritated. You know what I'm saying about my car, and, and and I'm a cool guy. You know what I'm saying I'm a cool ass guy. You know what I'm saying, and uh, that's why I feel like I mess up too much because I'm I'm nice. You get what I'm saying. So my boy T was telling me like, man, go get your shit. He playing with you, and you know what I'm saying. Like it shouldn't have took this damn long. You know what I'm saying. So then I start like I started thinking like, man, T, you right. You know what I'm saying. My car shouldn't have took this. Alone, you know what I'm saying? My car was up. My car was up there sitting for a week before he even touched the car. You know what I'm saying? And he told me my car was gonna be pulled in the shop that night or the next day to get looked at, and shit wasn't even. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't even that. It took a week for my car to even get looked at, man. Like you know what I'm saying? Like I'm being patient as ever. You know what I'm saying? And make so bad is. Y'all was lacking the content, you know what I'm saying? You know, this is like my car and your car, you know what I'm saying? So, it was just the whole point of me not having nothing to upload, no nothing like that. But we did end up getting the radiator fixed, you know what I'm saying? Everything is running perfectly. The numbers, cool, you know what I'm saying? The heat work and all that. Because you all used to know our radiator was busted. I got a picture of the radiator I'm putting on the screen. So, as y'all see, you know what I'm saying? He was just describing and telling y'all how the radiator looked and all that, you know what I'm saying? But... It, it, it just shouldn't have, it just shouldn't have to have been that long so uh i mean i guess i guess it is it is the big 300 is back you know what i'm saying please if y'all got any srt design seats please DM me on instagram i would travel to a certain extent you know what i'm saying gotta be in good condition you know what i'm saying electrical gotta work all that but you know what i'm saying i can't complain too much because the car is back y'all so I don't know, I, I guess it is what it is. Then it's, it just shouldn't have took this damn long. Now, y'all seen me get air, you know what I'm saying, the other day, two times y'all seen me get air. I come outside, do this video, this, you know what I'm saying, Sunday night, y'all gonna see this Monday. I come outside to get air, tire flat again. So now I got a, a cracked rim or just a bad tire. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully the rim ain't cracked, man. If it is, it's gonna push me to just get some different type of wheels for y'all, but. It's it just too much bullshit in the car scene, you know what I'm saying? Too much BS and I don't have time, you know what I'm saying? I just, I just don't got the time for it, you know what I'm saying? So, like I said, we gonna f continue to thug this out, get the videos rolling, get the videos popping, but nah, you know what I'm saying? Now I'm back to my normal update schedule, my normal upload schedule, you know what I'm saying? The banger content, man, I have seen a dip in views, you know what I'm saying? And uh, for my part, you know what I'm saying, if me not uploading, I should have some videos saved up, right? You know what I'm saying? I do apologize, but I was forewarning you guys that the car was going to be gone. I didn't tell y'all exactly when, you know what I'm saying? But I did tell y'all it was going to be gone, you know what I'm saying? Under the surgery, under the knife type of beat, you know what I'm saying? So, man, man, don't take your car no bullshit shot, man. I, 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 I had enough, man. So next video y'all gonna see from me is y'all gonna watch me send the big 300 and rate my subscriber cards. Y'all been sending me so many 
a different type of car. Now I got this video from my boy T-Baby right here on the screen. Go shout out to my boy T-Baby. I got this video from him, you know what I'm saying? He did it a while back. He actually did it a couple times, I remember, but man, y'all see me some heat. I, I kind of looked at him, you know what I'm saying? But I, I'm gonna pick him out, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get everybody's. I want at least do 20 cars. And I'm gonna end up setting the light goal on that video. We are gonna see if y'all wanna do it again. If we get a certain amount of likes, you know what I'm saying, we gonna do it again. If your car's been entered in there already, you know what I'm saying, you're pretty much in the video, you know what I'm saying? So everybody will get a little shout out, you know what I'm saying, on screen shout out and all that, how that's gonna go. But man, without further ado, this video is over, this video is done. My name is eBay Shot It, and I'm out of here. I ain't in the cap and let's keep it real. He could have held us, man, down, he took a deal. That's why I can't show nobody how we live. I got the news from my sister, gave me chills. Gang off, y'all pills, fucking up parties, it's just a thrill. He popped his hands and I dog itching to do a drill.